Well, UT Gardens is hosting its annual spring spectacular plant sale this weekend. Emily DeVoe explains what you need to know about this year's online event. Aside from the daffodils blooming around town, the annual UT spring plant sale is a sure sign of the changing season. Our spring plant sale is one of our biggest fundraisers of the year. It really goes a long way in helping support um, the operations of the garden here. On a picture perfect day like this, when signs of spring are blooming at the UT Gardens, it's easy to imagine what your own yard could look like. And a lot of new gardeners came online last year um, because um, people had an opportunity to be out in their own garden. They had nowhere else to go. So they started digging in their dirt and we have plants for them to put in those holes now. For the second year in a row, the annual spring plant sale will be online, allowing you to skim through dozens of plants at a time. We did find out that online plant sales do work. You know, a younger generation is more familiar with shopping online, um, getting Amazon, things from Amazon, that type of thing. So um, people are more comfortable buying things online, and uh, I think it was pretty successful. Garden staffers picked out six varieties they think will stand out this year. Our staff gets really excited, and it's really a round table discussion. It's like, oh, I like that. Oh, I like that. They include specific varieties of hydrangea, gardenia, shrubs, and the southern charmer, clematis, or clematis, tomato, tomato. Pickup is really easy and it's very contactless. We do everything for you. So you order online, um, we then bag your order together, we pull the plants for you, we have your name on them, your order on them, and then on pickup date, which is April 9th and 10th, um, you just pick a time to come in and then you pull up, give us a call, we take them out to your car and load them up. The only thing that we don't do is go to your house and plant them. We leave that for you. The online plant sale opens this weekend to members of the UT Gardens, and on Monday it opens to the public and runs through April 5th.